Good evening everyone. Myself Fabira Me Bivi, Assistant Professor from Department of English, Taiwan Amal College for Women. And today we are going to say about the poem A Song of Hope by Odi Gronanichal. So about the poem, I mean uh, the author Odi Gronanichal born in Queensland in the year 1920. She is a women activist, poet, writer. She raises voice against racial issues. On the other hand, she was awarded 6th Annual Oscar Award Ceremony hosted by U.S. Black Filmmakers Hall of Fame. Internationally acclaimed poet on the other hand, and on the other, she also di uh, she died in the year 1993 in Australia. So let us uh, look at the poem A Song of Hope by, written by Odegro Nanachal. So let me recite the poem. Look up, my people, the dawn is breaking, the world is waking to a new bright day when none defame us, nor color shame us, nor sneer dismay. So the whole stanza is all about the black people where uh, it is a conversation uh, between the daughter and the mother where uh, it's the conversation is all about the people, uh, the race of a particular community. So here in the first stanza, the my people which denotes a black people from an African society where they are, the dawn is breaking, the world is waking to a new bright day which denotes a symbol of a hope for their bright future. On the other hand, the last three line of the first stanza also denotes where none can defame them in future. So far they have been discriminated for so much of so many decades. Now in future they can no one can defame them or shame them by their color. This is all about the first stanza. And the second stanza now brood no more on the ears behind you, the hope assigned you. Shall the past replace when just or justice grown wiser and stronger points the bone no longer at a darker race the second stanza is all deals with uh, the african people who has been waiting for so much so many decades to get their freedom now they are in the hope where they will get their basic rights so their past memories and the past incidents will replace by their hope with a by seeking justice to them where they will grow more stronger and wise for at a darker race here the darker race denotes the black people in the third stanza so long we waited bound and frustrated till hate be hated and cast deep post now light shall guide us and all doors open that long were closed so the the, the third stanza is all about where the black people were waited for so many decades to get their freedom. So the frustrations and the discrimination they faced which pushed them into a frustration situation, into a depressed state. And now in present scenario with the hope, they see that the light shall guide us here. The light is nothing but the freedom they get in future. On the last two lines of the third stanza is very important when you uh, read and all those open that long were closed it is an important lines where the long were closed which denotes the opportunities were closed for the particular people I mean the community the African people now they all opportunities are going to open for them so this is all about the third stanza and the fourth stanza see plain the promised dark freedom lover nights nearly over and though long the climb new rights will greet us new mateship meet us and joy complete us in our new dream time so this fourth stanza is all about again the hope the promises uh, where they are waiting for their future and once they attain the freedom they will have the new rights where the rights have been denied for so many decades and where their dreams come true and future so on the last stanza of this poem i mean the four lines to our fathers fathers the pains the sorrow to our 
children's children the glad tomorrow so the last four lines is all about the pain and sufferings of their fathers how they are discriminated for so many decades at last the sufferings is going to end and in very future the people of particular race they have their children will enjoy their freedom with no discrimination at all so here the overview of the poem where one read the poem they can see how the racism point of view so here the author expresses views on racism and it is all about aboriginal australians the australians uh, that is the white on the other hand the black where the australians uh, on the other the poem highlights the conversation between the mother and the daughter so here the liberation and the empowerment of black people is much important in this poem the poem deeply connects the human conditions and emotions of a black people so uh, the overall the five stanza is all about uh, the black people emotions and their human condition how they are and to and on the sufferings they face from earlier stage and know how they are in hope for their better future so the connectivity of past present and future is all present in this poem so the themes the overall theme of this poem is all about the hope and positivity future dream liberation justice and equality so this is all the overall theme where it connects the liberations justice equality of a particular community called black people so uh, so many decades they have faced uh, so uh, the discrimination by the whites now they are hoping for their better future that's all about this poem thank you ulaga tharamana kalluri ungal ore devanaya mall college for women autonomous bilipuram ungal idirkalam ungal kaiyil